Orimoto Ditch Light System is the perfect solution for more light aimed exactly where you want it. From long range spotlights for high speed driving to ditch lights to illuminate the side of the road, our ditch light kit is all about versatility. Select a set of high performance off-road banger LED pods in your choice of beam pattern, paired with the brackets to make installation a breeze and power it properly with our switched wire harness. Morimoto's ditch light kit for the 2023 and newer Ford Super Duty has been through numerous rounds of design, prototyping, and testing directly on the truck to ensure perfect compatibility. Everything lines up with pre-existing mounting points to create an installation that is truly modification free. Each bracket is laser cut from 304 stainless steel and then powder coated. The white output version is ideal for all around visibility. For those who desire optimal output in rain, snow, or fog, the yellow output version will absolutely crush it in shady weather. We have incorporated mounting locations and cable routing clips on the stem of the bracket to direct the input wiring from your LEDs down into the engine bay. From there, you can plug and play with optional pigtails or Morimoto switched relay harness for a clean and reliable install. Just like the brackets, every element of the patented line of Banger LED pods is proprietary. Lucid Shape was used to optimize performance around the most modern lumen-dense LEDs from Nichia and Osram. Optics are produced according to world-class standards. They're available with four industry-leading beam patterns to suit every need. SAE wide slash fog, spot, combo, and flood. The combo beam pattern provides a blend of width and distance, making everyday driving in the middle of nowhere far more comfortable. The spot beam pattern illuminates far into the distance, unlike anything else on the market. The HXB spot comes standard with the most powerful OSRAM LEDs, which in combination with the TIR optics, produce a beam pattern capable of penetrating 800 meters into your future. The SAE wide beam pattern delivers the best combination of width, intensity, and control, making it the most effective LED light in the world. The flood beam is designed to diffuse the output of the potent Nichia or Osram chips within. Flood lens emits a very broad but shallow range of output. While physically compatible with the Big Banger pods, Morimoto does not recommend them for ditch light kits due to their above average weight, which can cause unwanted vibration. Begin by applying a strip of painter's tape to the windshield along the blade of the wiper. Do this on both sides. Remove the windshield wiper arms by lifting the wiper arm into the raised position, then pull out on the locking tabs and lift the arm straight up off the shaft. Repeat this on both sides. Remove the antenna by unscrewing it from its mount and raise the hood. Lift up on the end of the cowl, carefully but firmly prying up from one end to the other and releasing the clip securing it. Once fully released, move it back towards the windshield to get it out of the way. Moving to the bottom corner of the windshield and the upper rear corner of the fender, locate the 10 millimeter bolt securing the top of the fender. Behind the fender at the base of the hood hinge, locate the rearmost 13 millimeter bolt. Insert the included wire clip to the bracket with those two bolts removed, slide the bracket in between the fender and the hood hinge and over the two now empty bolt holes, reinstall the two bolts you removed to secure the bracket to the truck. Now repeat these steps on the opposite side. To install your pod lights, place the U bracket on top of the ditch light bracket. Secure it using the carriage bolt and 17 millimeter nut, holding the top of the bolt down with your hand and tightening the nut with a 17 millimeter wrench. Leave it slightly loose so the pod can be aimed later. Secure the pod to the U-bracket with the two provided screws using a T30 Torx bit. Leave these slightly loose as well to allow aiming later. Now do the same thing on the other side. Now we're going to install the wiring. If your truck has upfitter switches, you will not need the power switch that is included in the wiring harness. This switch can be removed and replaced with the included bare wire lead with barrel connector. This will allow you to connect to the upfitter switches. Now we can proceed to mounting the relay harness. Let's start by mounting it somewhere in this area. Be sure to mount it upright so there's no water intrusion. Next, we're gonna connect to the upfitter switch. Connect to any upfitter switch that you want in this case, we're gonna to connect to aux one. Check your user manual to find out which color connects to which switch. Strip back the wire. Now you can install a butt connector or solder.
Now strip back the blue wire that you have connected to your relay harness. Install your butt connector. Connect these two wires and crimp your butt connector, and then ensure everything is connected properly. Now route one of the Deutsch connectors up to the passenger side ditch light bracket. Connect it to the back side of any banger that you choose. For the second light, we're gonna route it around the front of the vehicle, underneath the cowl, and back up to the ditch light. We'll need both included extensions. Grab your extension, connect it, and work your way across. Now you can connect your second extension. Now you can connect it to the second light that you installed. The last two wires you have are the negative and positive wire. And we're gonna start with the negative here. You can install it however you want, but this is how we saw fit. Once your ground wire is installed, grab your positive wire and connect it here. Test it to make sure everything works, and if so, zip tie everything up for a clean install. Don't forget to reinstall your windshield wipers, cowl, and antenna. Now get out there and enjoy your new ditch light brackets from Morimoto. To see all other products that we have for your 23 plus Super Duty, go to morimotolighting.com.